perfect day for football at Lumen Field in Seattle. Today it's week three and we've got a good one in store between the Arizona Cardinals and the Seattle Seahawks. With Charles Davis, I'm Brandon Gordon. Charles, you look at this Seahawks team as they get ready here. An early season tilt, and when it's an early season tilt, should be ready to roll. Well, let's face it, the aches and pains haven't really set in yet, and both teams eyeing a really good start to get things going. Meanwhile, for the visiting Cardinals here, even with all the games we have broadcast together over the years, partner, seems like every time we see something new and kind of get that feeling we might get something unique here in this one as well. No two games ever really the same, are they, Brandon? Because there's always a couple little details, standout performances, big plays that help set each game apart. That makes every one of them entertaining to be a part of. Have athletes back there taking the snaps, guys who can throw it and move around and get yards with their legs if needed. He's one of the best examples that we see out there right now. He can throw for hundreds of yards one week and then run for 100 plus the next. He adds an extra. They begin with a quick throw out left. Give him three there on the first play of the game. Their ability to force turnovers, three of them in fact. Being able to take the ball away, give it back to their offense, that's something that's emphasized each and every week, and they carry it out. And room to run as he's up past the 35-yard line. He gets him seven that time, but it'll lead to a third down. Now a handoff up the middle. Irving. And this is going to be a Cardinals first down as he'll get this up to about the 42. The Cardinals hit 2-0 here to begin the season. And they come in feeling pretty good after back-to-back -back victories, CD. And I thought that they played pretty well last week. Their execution, their discipline, their resilience. Ready! Now on first down, he'll drop to throw it. Pass to the right, and he's got McBride. It'll be a gain of five, and it'll be color two. Wasn't able to do that there, but still good yardage. Got his man complete over the middle. It's Carr. And they'll get this down to around the 47-yard line. That was a route run, not just with... On first down, he'll drop to throw. And this is caught. Puts it on the carpet. It's out. And the Seahawks have picked it up. And wow. He got blown up there. Dang, man. And a look here at the veteran under center. Their seventh-year quarterback. I tell you what, when he's on schedule for that week, secondaries take notice because you've got to stay alert back there on every snap. A truly powerful arm, one that's capable of challenging any level of the deep on any given play. That's why so many scouts that's preach crazy. arm talent when preparing for the NFL draft. A quarterback with arm strength to make every throw in the book, he's an asset to have in any offense. Here's Walker to start the drive. And he'll be oh, great run defense. We come in allowing 42 yards rushing a game in the first two games. I like the strategy. Extra tight ends, extra beef. They want to run the football, but that means they probably want to run it inside. No, not at all. They did a really nice job staying in their proper places and not allowing any lanes to open up. Oh, I'm watching. I'm watching, man. Out of the gun now on third down. Or the sack, right? You meant that too. Christian Harris in there for the sack. It always helps for a visiting team to come in and set the tone on defense. In fact, when we talked with them prior to the game, they said they wanted this home crowd to feel like they had to hide. Their so the Cardinals offense back onto the field here for their second drive of the game. Now, early on, you know, Charles, every game could be called a measuring stick game. But I think when it comes within your division like this, it's a measuring stick game with a little extra entry. I would agree with that totally because all division games... Have Thanks, man. Wide situation. open. Tank Dell. We'll take the first this down. The season, this guy is consistent. Glad we have him. At the same time, it's not a make or break if this... They'll run on first down. Irving will get this up to about the 44. Now, during uh -oh. the run, an injury. Uh -oh. 
The run got four. Now they deal with a second and six. Ready, go. go. Off the play fake. He'll look to throw. Oh, he's got a man wide open. Another dot. A dot to tank bill. going to be made at the Seahawks 39. A busy first quarter. His third catch of the afternoon is a first down. And that's a more than four weeks. So from Seahawk territory now, it's first and ten at the 39-yard line. Up the middle they go. Irving. This will be stopped about two yards shy of the marker. Eight-yard gain, second and two. Simply not much more you can ask out of your running back. Over 100 yards and the three touchdowns. And for an old coot like me, I loved it. Get in a couple. They'll keep it on the ground. Irving. And he'll be a little shy of the 25 here at the 26-yard line. A gain of five. Good enough for the first down. He was solid last week, over 100 yards. It's not necessarily the same, but they want it to be, right? What they saw last week on the ground, they want to see in this game as well. Now a man open down the middle of the field, and they're going to get this down inside the 20. And like this, they want him to get the ball and run after the catch. Good job there, though, holding him for a short game. Second down, here's an option right. He'll get two on the keeper, but it becomes now a third down. On third down, Irving. And boy, he is very close to a first down. Oh, <laughs> uh, we came up just short. Might end up going for this. Carries of just two yards. Ladies and gentlemen, that is a force of nature at the defensive tackle position. Yes, he's as big as they come, but still plenty agile. He's able to make a nice play there to swallow up the ball carrier. They'll try and sneak it here. And he picks up the first down yard. So easy a caveman could do it. <laughs> Good call. Now they'll switch it up here and look to throw. Able to get this one to McBride. And he takes it inside the 10 to the 8 before he's out of bounds. Yeah, he's actually, uh, as long as I work him in his skill level, he's good. There's Barry down to the two-yard line. Big first down. When they came into this game saying it was important that they set the tone and show that they can run the football, I believe that they've done that here in the first quarter. He'll look to throw. Under pressure, down he goes. I was going to hit Barry in the flat, but that sucked. Seven yards on first and goal, so now it's second down. Good job keeping that in mind as he escaped, bought time, and decided throwing it away was his best option. Touchdown. Now that's a dot. Touchdown. Tank Dell. His first touchdown here of the new campaign. And the Cardinals get the upper hand as they're on the board first here this afternoon. All drives that result in points hurt it. Do better than that first drive where they went three and out. And sometimes the first drive is just simply to settle nerves. You know what it's like at the start of a game with the emotion. Guy's a little I bit don't, jumpy. But you do. Oh, you, you understand the same way. Just like <laughs> us calling one, right? Making sure we ease it for six yards. And this will wind up being a third and three. They'll look to throw. Good stop, man. Way to go, defense. Buda Baker. Whenever I see a crowd, as opposed to being away from it and maybe having a little bit more space. Wow, a fake field goal, guys. A fake field goal. But it's a turnover on 10. Try and start this drive in the air. He'll get this complete to Rondell Moore. And he'll get it after a gain of seven to the 40. It is. <clears throat> that's the first time that's happened in this franchise in eight years. A fake field goal. There we go. Big bad Barry. 
enemy territory just across midfield at the that is a rare incompletion that's a bad throw man it's kind of scary way up not that time and he'll get this into enemy territory but not by much as he's down to the 14 yards to pick up the first Oh, there goes Barry with the sure-handed catch in the first down. Passing game's clicking. Kingsbury game's clicking. Kingsbury's happy about it. I'm not sure that that was necessarily a safety valve or a check down throw on third down. Sometimes just try and find the open guy and get him the ball. He did exactly that. Line of scrimmage, the 37 on first and 10. Uh, this should be a good run. Now a off oh, yeah, for sure. Get him down after a Gain of eight. That's a start as this drive goes on. We're seeing an offensive line of running game imposing its will. On second down now. Ah. Almost. God should get it. Let's see. What it does is emphasize the strategic football and situational football is not just playing on the offensive side. Good deal. Whoa. Where the first down marker was and making sure. Jumping around like a freaking bronco. So far this season, this is an offense has proved its ability to move the football. I mean, they're in the top five in the NFL and picking up first downs, and they get the conversion here. And I think a lot of that is due to how they win on progress down the field was halted by that incompletion. They could try for some set yards here to get things moving again, or keep throwing it and pushing it downfield to try and pick up bigger yardage. Good deal, good grief. Like it. Wide open again. Tank Dell. Big first half. He's going to mark down just outside the 10. Out of the gun. They'll look to throw. He's got McBride here over the middle. All right. McBride inching closer to the goal line. To the four yard line. Inching closer to the goal line. To the four yard line. Barry time. And there he is. Oh, they're going to call him down at the one. Of course not, because you're a bunch of cheaters. <laughs> there we go. That time I know he's in. He dove over the top. Good run. touchdown now on the year and the Cardinals have taken a two touchdown lead now so this has been a pretty strong start to the year for him on the ground taking a two touchdown lead now so this has been a pretty strong start to the year for him on the ground CD it's just week three that's already five rushing touchdowns and you know he's got big grins on their faces besides the rest of the uh oh here. Isaiah Simmons is hurt on the field Hopefully, obviously nothing serious here. Medical staff, though, going to take a peek, and we'll take a break. Ready up. The card's going nickel. An extra defensive Check back pick. out there now Nick. on third White. down. Check White. They'll try for the first with Walker. No gain on the play there. Nice Good play. stuff by the run defense there. Christian Harris. Situation on four. As usual, the hallmark of a good run defense, linebackers making plays near the line of scrimmage. Absolutely nowhere to run there. 
And good work bringing that one back as he picks right, a return of 16. Return. And that will come the offense as they take over. A look at the running back, the man out of the backfield as he gears up to go again. And he's well on it. Right. Those guys have an innate <laughs> sense of where they are in a ball game and how many yards they've accumulated because you know they're always working towards 100. He's been working well towards 100 here. Ben is McBride. Big play. Gronk Jr. Very solid gain of 27. Good job there of getting his tight end involved because he lines up on the right side of the formation, just works his way across, spotted the open gap in the zone, and his quarterback found him, and they get a first down. So from Seahawk territory now, it's first and 10 at the 43. He'll drop to throw. Looking left side, that's caught by Moore. There's Rondell Moore, right up the seam. Big play, big play. 24 yards the game there, another first down as well. Good strong throw and catch right there. And so far in this game, the alleys have been open for them to get. Let's go. Well, they don't need to run another play here before the two-minute warning. Let's see if they do it anyway. On first down, Irving. And he'll get this down only to the 18. Just a yard on the first. 60 boxes, 60 boxes. On second down now. Irving, down he goes at the 10. Man, almost had it. He was stretching. That's a really nice in detecting it and blocking it and turning it into a nice run. And a lot of times you think if you blitz a running play, you're going to smother it. But a lot of the blitzers, they come in a little bit high. They don't have great leverage, and they're easily blocked and turned to the side. On third down, Colbert. And he's got the first down as he gets it to the eight. Brad, what were they thinking on defense there? They looked like they were playing for the pass. That was third and short. Yeah, it was an easy pickup because a few men in the box there. Got it. Ready? Here's first and goal, and gosh, points here. A chance maybe to put this thing away before Ready? halftime. They're going to look to throw. Throw left side. There's Schwartz with it. They'll get this. He was hoping he'd get lost behind the defensive line. But once he made the catch, nowhere to turn up field and gain any yardage. And he'll take this one in. Big Bad Barry, touchdown, number two. A great effort there with his second touchdown here in this first half. And the Cardinals will extend their lead in the final minute of the half. Well, I don't think that we're ready yet to say the route is on, but they have certainly looked near flawless here. They're flawless here in this first half, and now an extra point away from making it 21-0. Yeah, and your experience led you to say that because we have both seen those 21 to nothing leads come and go in this league, but this one feels pretty darn secure, and here's the other drive. Nowhere to go here. He lost the football. Wow, Christian Harris is on a tear. That's his second sack and a forced fumble. Dangerous spot for this big lead. And you have to figure they'll lean on it a little bit more in the third and fourth quarters. Meanwhile, for the Seahawks, there's a look at what they were able to do throwing the football. And they'll need to get things in gear as they trail here at the break. It's up third down. This offense in desperate need of a conversion as they come up on third down. Back to throw. Good stop. What a defensive stop. He's averaging just under 50 yards upon as he gets this away. And it's taken in at the nine. All right, good run back. Can it, Sam? Yard punt. Well done. Take it. And they will take over first and better seat comfortably ahead. They've scored on a couple straight possessions, Charles. And I mean, for them, I guess it's just more of the same, right? Keep doing what you've been doing. Yeah, oh, Barry stopped in the backfield one of the few times that's happened. Unstoppable in this one. It does appear like they're done scoring points in this one. They look awfully confident. The play action fake. They'll look to throw. That's complete to McBride. <laughs> it's a good catch. Almost wish he would have. Pick up the first. <laughs> On third down, they'll drop to throw. There's Schwartz. Here's Schwartz complete. 
And he'll be stopped here. Well We're going to be sure. We're going to punt the ball away. First line. punt of the game. Yeah, that's good for a gain. Stopped here. Well We're going to be sure. We're going to punt the, the ball away. First line. punt of the game. And that's good for a gain of six. And that's going to make it fourth down. Brandon, a good idea there. On Malik Cunningham, extremely oh, accurate this game so far. On the return. And it'll be Seahawk football first and ten. So they'll come up first and ten now from the 33. Nice defense. Oh, the ball's loose, and we get it back. The rookie recovers. Wow. Good defense. The rookie recovers his first fumble. Big run for Barry. Running to the outside. Down to the nine. Closing in on 100 now. On the ground now as he has been terrific here this afternoon. He's turning in a pretty impressive performance running the football and a big reason why they have this nice lead. And in right back to him on There we go to the outside. Touchdown. Big Bad Barry is third rushing touchdown. The outside touchdown. Big Bad Barry is third rushing touchdown. Fourth down. That was Dean, the backup man. Let's spin. Nice run. Big Bad Barry. What? Ah. Uh, well, shucks. Fumble. Shucks. Fumble. Might have been down. Let's see. He might have been down, man. No, he wasn't. Nice. That was a good catch. No offense. Still, I'm asking that might have been why Burrow threw so many picks. Hundred yards already. Three rushing touchdowns. And that's really good. Good five yard game. Don't want to push it. Oh man, he undercut it. Dang it. All right, tight. Oh man. Blew right through, my guy. Dennis Walker is still twenty-one to fourteen, but still sitting in a great spot. Up two scores here in the third quarter. And All right, there goes Schwartz with the first down. Oh, eight and nine. What? 
always laugh when people say, what's the toughest route to defend? And I'm like, any of them. Especially if it's a good receiver, that makes things very difficult. But when you're running a drag route, something short, shallow, going through defenders, using guys almost as, as screens in order to get open. All right, good play. Another first down. Uh, there's McBride with another catch. Call it a gain of six on the play. You can get up a little bit. You can get some significant yardage hitting your tight end on that one. On second down, Colbert. I thought he could get it over there. All right, third and two. They'll go with a touch pass here, trying to pick it up. And no, he didn't get it. Fourth and one. What a way to end the third quarter. All right, fourth and one. Big, big run from Malik Cunningham. Twelve yards on fourth and one. Wide open, Colbert. God, he's clutch. And he's going to be taken down at the 28-yard line. Partner, I like that they're staying aggressive on offense because to me, this drive, that might put this one to bed. I like the fact that they're playing with confidence and not playing with fear. Now on first down, he'll Again, he's open. Diving inside the 10. And he gets it inside the 10 to the 9. He's been a one-man wrecking crew these last couple of plays. This time, 18 more and a first down. These guys God, there's a bullet. Barry has three rushing touchdowns. Let's make that four. Four rushing touchdowns today. For the big man. And the Cardinals are closing in on a third straight Man. I've heard you use the term put away drive, and that right there seemed like the definition of a put away drive. Yeah, it certainly just pops. E the easiest tackle of his life. And that brings up third and a full 10 yards. I thought that wasn't a bad time to call the screen. I thought late game, down on the scoreboard, had to figure they were expecting a pass down field. Oh, look at the pass rush. There he is again, Christian Harris with his third sack. Christian Harris able to disrupt yet another pass play. That is his third sack of the afternoon. Way to go, man. Pass rush is looking great. Nice! Buda Baker comes up with the clutch pass defense. Cunningham's also got 44 on the ground. Oh man, big run, Barry. Gain of 10. On third and one. First down, Arizona. No doubt those are the types of carries they're looking for and for here, Charles. The lead in the fourth quarter. This is when coaches that have a reliable running game, they breathe a little easier on the sideline. Yeah, they love the idea that they can take the air out of the football at this point of the game. That means they're really counting on that offensive line clock. And if you have the ball, they can't score. Running game working There we go. Keep pounding. Six yards. Right 
Nice cutback. Nice. There's, they can't stop it, man. There's no way. No way to stop Big Bad Barry, man. It carries like that. That's how they're going to continue to salt this thing away here, Charles, in the fourth quarter. Get your reset. All runs on this drive so far. It's first and ten. Right up the middle, man. And not a whole lot of room to operate there on the first down run. He gets maybe three. Okay. I can stand up when the going gets tough in here. Again, up the middle, very dragging tacklers, 150 yards. There we go, first down. Gain of three. He's just tired this defense out. And a little bit of a surprise, they lose the turnover battle, but wind up winning the ball game. And this is very unusual because you know all teams stress winning the turnover battle as a key indicator to winning ball games. So when you get something that goes against the grain, like the 